Hello Libra, welcome to my channel. My name is Isabel from the TarotEmpress.com. I'm going to be doing a general tarot card reading today for you guys. So you could get messages pertaining to your love life. You could get messages that are relating to your career. You could get messages that are relating to your personal life, okay? So the purpose of this reading is to provide you with as much guidance as possible in terms of your life. Okay, so listen very carefully. There's going to be a very, you know, unique sort of view on how things are happening in your life. Okay, obviously this is a different type of tarot card reading and uh, some of you might not be used to it, but keep an open mind. Now, when it comes to these energies, just know that this could play out in the next week. Or it could play out during this week. It could even play out, you know, in three weeks' time. So just take the messages and apply it. So let's see. The first card that I'm looking at is giving me the indication that for some of you, you really tried very hard, you know, or you are currently trying very hard to be as patient as possible. I feel like if you were working towards a goal, if you've been working towards a relationship as well, it could be anything, okay? But the investment of your time in something very specific has taken up a lot of your energy and it has absorbed a lot of your passion, okay? So I feel like there might have been something that you were continuously striving towards and you might be feeling like, when is this ever going to turn in your favor? When is it going to be your time to enjoy the fruits of your labor? Okay, so this particular card, it comes with the energy of feeling as if what you're waiting for is not going to pay off. Well, that is an incorrect way of thinking because I feel like what you're working towards is going to pay off in a really big way, okay? So the cards are indicating that, you know, what you're doing right now is something that you should not allow yourself to give up on. If you are studying very hard, if you are working towards a promotion, if you are, you know, trying to fix a relationship, whatever you're working towards, don't give up. Don't feel as if, you know, you need to leave everything the way it is and move on to the next thing. So the cards are saying that the effort you've been putting in, it might make you feel frustrated in this moment, but perhaps all you need to do is take a step back and relax. You know, take a step back so that you can think about what it is that you are actually going towards, what it is that you actually want out of the situation. So let's see. The next cards are talking about communication, okay, and movement. And I feel like you really must think before you speak. There could be, you know, a buildup of frustration in the month of October or even going into the beginning of November. And in whatever aspect of life it is, you know, that communication might set off a chain effect and it might have, you know, the consequence of things falling apart. And that's not necessarily what you want, okay? So the cards are being very clear. If you've been feeling as if what you've been doing is not working, you're much closer towards your end objective than you real realize, okay? I also feel like it's calling upon you to rest, to take a breath and to really collect your thoughts. There's something that you need to contemplate before you actually, you know, initiate in your life. If you're thinking about saying certain things or doing certain things in a specific situation, the cards are saying, hold back. You know, I also see from these specific cards that you know, in light of things happening in the zodiac and astrology, there could be certain things that are going on that are beckoning change. 
and I'm seeing communication that could potentially result in some form of change. This could be something coming out. You know, with the combination of the cards here, I'm guessing that there might be somebody that might have been keeping something from you or hiding something from you. They may not have done it so intentionally. I don't feel like they may have done it to be shrewd towards you, okay? I feel like the cards are indicating that this individual was trying to make things work and it was never their intention to try to deliberately hurt you. But I feel like you might have been waiting for some time for this person to open up, okay? This could be in your work, your love life, it could be in any aspect. But I feel like something may have been kept from you and something that, um, you know, you're not particularly seeing during this period of time. I feel like if you are a cross-watcher and if you been keeping like a secret from a Libra individual, the truth will literally set you free. So I'm sensing here that something needs to come out in the open and it is advising Libra to not overreact to this, okay? And it's telling you to be as balanced as possible. So this is not something that is going to cause as much chaos or devastation in your life is just something that will come out and uh, you'll think to yourself well they should have told you from the beginning there was no reason to hide this and I feel like you might feel like this individual you know you don't know what to do with them because they told you this this could even be a close friend this could be a lover this could be somebody at work maybe they knew that a promotion was coming or you know could go either way, but I do feel like this individual was feeling as if they were doing something for your good. And um, they were trying to be protective in an indirect way. At the same time, I feel like, you know, they thought that they were the individual that was wiser in the situation. You know, they underestimated your ability to grasp it. They thought perhaps, you know, you wouldn't be able to process it in that way. Maybe you had a lot on your plate, but I feel like something is definitely being kept from you. The way I look at the cards now, it's starting to make even more sense. I'm just going to pull out a few more cards. So the cards are indicating that there's a lot of people involved here and you know the situation is not as it seems. I feel like there might be more than one individual or two potentially three individuals that are aware of this and um, you know you're going to have to look very closely to see who could be keeping something from you or what is really going on here because I feel like there's an element here that you've been feeling frustrated, you've been feeling like there's a blockage or something standing in your way, so something hasn't been feeling right inside of you and you haven't been able to put your finger on it. But I feel like there's going to be this massive turnaround and the cards are telling you, don't give up, you're very close to discovering something, don't lose hope, you know, there's no need for you to become disgruntled, sad or upset with any particular person, but I feel like some of you will feel like you know, you should have known, you should have been in the loop, you shouldn't have been kept out of it. But for some reason I'm seeing here that once you know this piece of information, you can, you're can you probably going to be able to use it to your advantage. This could be something that's going to even happen in the workplace for some of you, okay? So there's something that people might be talking about or discussing and you might not be aware of it. But once you know it, I feel like it's going to be to your great grand advantage, okay? So, you know, look much deeper at what's going on in your life. If you are in the process of, you know, getting your education or, you know, trying to work towards a promotion, maybe you were supposed to be doing things in a different way. Maybe, you know, even your lover could have been, you know, keeping things from you or one or two things and they didn't tell you and it's going to change this whole situation around. And, um, you know, it's going to be a positive change. It's going to be a change that you're not really going to know is coming into your life so it 
will be something that takes you by surprise, okay? I hope you guys enjoyed your tarot card reading. If you want a personal one, you can get it at thetarotempress.com. If you like these type of readings, click the thumbs up. You know, you can't just look at life in terms of interpreting your love life. You have to look at the full big picture because if one aspect is not working properly, you know, you can't fix the other aspect because it means that a piece of the puzzle is missing, okay? Have a wonderful day and take care.